Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome once again to Tokaris Live here on RVTV. How we all doing, everybody? Yes, we know. We keep putting this shit off over and over and over again, but we finally got it going again. Hopefully, we got at least a little time before the next time we got to take a break. And there goes my phone. Fuck you. <laughs> God damn it. Get right out the gate. Right out the gate. Fuck's sake. Anyway, you know who I am. You know who's with me. I'm the Shades. My name is Matty J. And I'm Easy Rider. And, of course, you guys have noticed that, yes, we are now down one hero. As I explained last time when we did this, when we finished up, uh, go go five we will not be adding a new show on to this uh, so we will be doubling up we're gonna be rolling double sevens for the foreseeable future so instead of we just... see nothing wrong with that strategy nope <laughs> once we finish with just beyond we're gonna have nothing but ultraman on here yeah that's gonna be nuts <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> you know, for the longest time, we kept put we kept putting Ultraman off to the side. We're like, eh, we're not ready to touch that. We're going to be ending the Twitch era of Tokaris with nothing but Ultraman. Like, we are making up for lost time. Basically. <laughs> I find nothing wrong with that statement. Nope. Nope. But let's not do it. This... <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, let's, rewind. Not, <laughs> let's rewind that back a little bit. Let's not delay this any further. Let's uh, pull the one arm bandit because we're hitting the jackpot at seven, seven, seven. <laughs> ah, uh, hairball, I already know of what you speak. I've or uh, brother Coops has already gotten his button. Yeah, we, we had a feeling he may or may not be available for the show, so we there we, he was in our tsunami call. He has been ser he hath been serenaded. Yes. So don't worry. The tradition still holds. We have not forgotten. I know it's been a while. It's been a while. But it's been we, a while. Have, we have not forgotten. Yes, anyway, time for a double as as YGM so eloquently put it. Time for a double dose of who's pissed off Ultra 7 this week. <laughs> who's he going to murder next? Whatever the fuck I want. Pretty much. Pretty much. So let's go ahead and get down it now. So make sure you guys got the links pulled up. Of course, check the about section in the Twitch channel if you want to have those links ready for you. I did. I almost forgot to update them, but I remembered in time. So not a botch. <laughs> Anyway, let's go ahead and get this party underway, ladies and gentlemen. Ultra 7, episode 25. Showdown at 140 degrees below zero. In three, two, one, lay. We're doing this in Antarctica? Apparently. Dude, is Ultra 7 going to fight the thing? It's Ultra 7, the thing. Roll at the South Pole. And fuck you anyway. <laughs> now, is it 140 Fahrenheit or 140 Celsius? I think either way, it's going to be fucking cold. Actually, is it minus 140 or yes. 140? Below they said 140 zero? degrees below, below zero. zero okay. So okay. yeah, minus. Yeah. So either way, it's gonna be fucking cold. <laughs> yeah. I think I think we'd be beyond Lewis Black cold at this point. Maybe Fuck it's cold. Some, maybe we can move this fight somewhere a little warmer, say Siberia. Right. <laughs> also, Zezomet, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. Twenty-eight months total. I gotta turn my fan over here. It's Maybe cold where they're going to be fighting, but it's actually hot over here in Florida. Well, you, 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 well, the devil does live in Florida. I mean, the governor. Uh, 
And that's as far as I'm going on this one tonight, folks. Fuck Trust em. me. To be fair, though, does the temperature ever really change in Florida? It does, but never to an extreme degree. It's either it's either like slight, slightly chill, hot, or fuck it's hot. There you go. Well, we're lost. Not lost. We're lost. Not, Not lost. lost. Where, where, where are we? Not lost. We're lost. Not. <laughs> <laughs> Will you I'm just pull over and ask for directions? Is I cannot pull over and ask for directions. Why not? Because I'm no, a don't man. Don't back in. Don't back in. You'll get stuck. The wheels will be turning. He's stuck. Uh, also, did it look folks, like the car was floating at one point? It was, technically. By the way, nothing worse in the winter than getting stuck in snow and the, and the tires spinning. Nothing. I told him I told him to put chains around the tires. They never listen. Like, oh, I got a strong-ass motor in here. It can handle it. It's not the motor that's the problem, no. dumbass. It's not the motor. It's not even in the torque. It's the, it's the traction. See, that's what happens when you have all-season tires. SCTV yep. is on the air. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait a minute. Guys, this isn't Goldeneye, right? No. Not to my knowledge. We're, this is not... This is not Severnaya, right? No. Okay. Because the last thing we would need is 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 a gene as a dream gene gray look like having an orgasm over a death count. Yes, folks, and that Sean was Bean thing. dying, and Sean Bean dying again. Yeah, yeah. Because it's not a Sean Be Sean Bean movie unless he's dead. That's every, his time contract. They, they, every time they give him a script, he's like, okay, well, how am I dying this time? Quick ch quick check on that coffee. Anyone else had th th that one Austin Powers joke in their head? This coffee uh, tastes like shit. Mr. Powers, it is shit. Well, I've lost my appetite. Thank you, man. <laughs> Sorry. Shrinkage on an epic level. Otherwise, other than that, I'm fine. Oh, rub it oh. in, bitch. Right? Oh, I'm, thanks. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm miles from the nearest Starbucks. Thank you. Uh, the damn thing's frozen in, and it's stuck, you twat. Ugh. Just ask himself, what would red green do? No, no, I said we looked at it as it just as I thought. It's a fucking Ford. Mm. Fix or repair daily. Hey, yo. Whoa! Uh, not the coffee! Not the coffee! <laughs> oh, the, the coffee. No, not the coffee! Ah, that thing's set on the Dan Haggerty level of flame. Hell yeah. Seriously, you need some spot welding done with that lighter? <laughs> that's like that, that's like, again, going back to James Bond, that's like that flamethrower lighter he has in License to Kill. The one he set uh, Robert Dobby on fire with. Oh, yeah. Also, since we brought the thing earlier, more bullshit wants the flamethrower, more bullshit wants the what? <laughs> yeah, the land, the uh, the ultra ultra brothers are used to a warmer climate. I mean, they literally come from a place called the Land of Light. You would think a, a warm location would be kind of the norm for them. And they're solar powered. Yeah. All I have to say is, and if Monk was in the chat, he'd agree. Pussies. Just. It's cold. You have not, you, Antarctica or not, you have not lived a Canadian winter. Well, good time to steal office supplies, I guess. Hell yeah. yeah. 
Another day, another box of stolen pens. <laughs> Ooh, somebody's not paying the bills around here. Well, I've been working in a coal mine, working in a coal mine. Oh, crap. The canary. Oh, Guess out of the hole. Ugh, and that's just his breath. Talk about a case of chronic halitosis. We're going to need the give, world's give, biggest Altoid. Give <laughs> that, yeah, give that <laughs> curiously strong. <laughs> give that, give that, give that kaiju a TikTok. I was fucking kidding earlier. Oh my God. Oh my. I was fucking kidding. What are you talking about? This is the thing. Guys, mint Tic Tacs, not cinnamon. It'll make it worse. Easy. I think we become uh, soothsayers over here. We've been doing this too long. Yeah. And you people wonder why. And you people wonder why we're trying to hang it up. <laughs> we're so good at predicting these, these tropes. It's not even funny anymore. Yep. Well, we can make it funny, but you know. We're going to have to operate. Don't worry. I won't feel a thing. You're not a surgeon. Are you kidding? I just removed 900. I just removed $900 from someone. Later. What did he have? $900. No, what was the prop? What was the thing you took away from him? The $900. What was his complaint? The $900. <laughs> Oh, we got a newbie in our chat, Chalice of Hearts, who I know just joined the server recently. Hello. Welcome to the family. We're like the Olive Garden when you're here, your family. Just don't expect Vin Diesel to say family 10,000 times. Or endless breadsticks. Oh, God, no. But we do know a couple of spots for that, though. Uh, yeah, you'd be dead. Oh, yeah, good point. <laughs> oh, yeah, one thing, though, if you ever want to flash freeze a shitload of beef, now would be the time to do it. Yep. Ah, uh, he's more upset that they are they don't have their cable and they're missing and they're missing the Jets game. No TV and no beer make Homer something, something. Go crazy. Hey, I thought it was 140 degrees before zero. False advertising. Seriously, what the fuck? You guys are pussies. I mean, it's government run, so they get they gotta make everyone wear, wear their fucking parkas. Order the evacuation oh. quickly. Do we always have to alert people when we have to use the bathroom? Uh what about having a what about having a duty to not freeze our nips off? Ah, took care of the of the butt there, boss. Yep. <sighs> we welcome all so new much. users, except for bots. Bots could go to hell. Yeah. Ah, spring in Minnesota. <laughs> Actually, I think that's the end of spring in Minnesota, but we'd have to verify that with, with Mildred. Excuse me, with Mildred the Monk. Eh, April in Minnesota, more likely. Fair, fair. Yeah. That's March in Quebec, folks. Stand up. Be counted. Move your body. Move your body. Make sure you don't hurt nobody. Uh, I want to go to school that day. Five more minutes, Mom. I went screaming and he, in Ultra 7. I'm freezing, you twits. JMC, I think the only reason he hasn't pulled that card yet is because they have a limited energy, so he has to use that only when absolutely necessary. And the sun's not out. Plus, if he does that already, we've got no show or no episode. Yeah. Gotta drag this out somehow. My God has forsaken me. <sighs> I think we found Miro's God. Promise margarine, a new kind of spread. Nice dissolve. Space Ghost! We are the hot dog men! Props to anybody who got that reference. I fucking Space got that. Space Ghost! 
host. We are the hot dog men. The alien pole. We saw. So, sorry, we just couldn't. We couldn't afford a budget for this scene, folks. We're gonna freeze it with a background of fire. Ah, yes. Sailor got it. Also, is it me or is these the aliens sound like they're voiced by the freaking chipmunks? Right? Yeah. Well, they needed some so they need some work on the side after their record started uh, slumping. By the way, if you're wondering why we're gonna have a background of fire, it's fucking freezing. We wanna see the we wanna see the earth freeze, not actually be frozen. We're not that fucking idiots. Ugh. <sighs> I think they had those puppets because the snow ate up 90% of the budget. You know, I wouldn't be surprised. Snow it, is difficult to produce. Blast. Uh-oh. Oh, he shit. dropped it back there. Well, that was not the time. <laughs> well, you oh. asked. You asked. Folks. Oh. Folks, nothing worse than losing your, your anything in 10 foot of snow. Imagine losing your smartphone in the snow. In that, oh, in smartphone's that easy. You just you, you 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 if you if it's connected to another device, you call it you, and you could find it. But imagine what about your keys, keys, your wallet, your wallet. Yeah, you're fucked. Yep. Now we got a title. Title drop. Uh. Is this the really is this really a great time to show off your new Bluetooth speaker? Well, we have to show it off because I lost it in the snow. I can't believe we're actually doing the Velma from Scooby Doo bit. And this predates Scooby Doo. Space Ghost! We are the hot dog men! Does anybody have a Phillips screwdriver? <laughs> Hey, no stealing M. Bison's line. Seriously, man. Gimmick infringement. We don't care. You won't even have time to sue. You know the uniforms are used when the whites that used to be whites are compared to snow and they're off-white now? Oh, and to the add to the you're so fucked. Also... I hope nobody's allergic to coconut because that's probably what they use for snow, shredded coconut. I mean, it's it's what works. Yep. Hey, read between the lines, pal. All right, let's beat him up. Fuck, it's cold. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. Why did you keep me in your pants down there? It stinks! Seriously, shower! Oh, now that, now that I said that, and I thought they smelled bad. <sighs> On the outside! <laughs> keep in mind, folks, we reference a good Star Wars movie here. That wasn't even a Star Wars reference. I mean, it was, but it well, was, it was. A it, It's Wars. a reference to a reference to a Star Wars movie. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> to be fair, I'll... <laughs> be glasses is no time to be dancing a jig. Now, what the fuck are they doing? Are they fighting or are they fucking? Yeah, a boy is a little cold. Oh, Cole, be doing that right now. Why are you giving him a piggyback ride? <laughs> I just got flashbacks. There was a C4 show, C4 wrestling show, post blizzard, falls count anywhere, all the snow around that the wrestle around did. Y'all thought wrestling on Legos sucked. Try taking a bump on snow, flat back, naked back. Ah, yeah. Having having jumped in snow to topless uh, once, not fun. You'll be okay. We're just gonna remove a kidney through your ear. Oh, 
Okay, who covered my phone in coconut shavings? That was not funny, guys. What is this, The Office? Also, even if they do manage to get the get the, the stone to melt, uh, all that equipment is now completely wrecked. Uh, yeah, this is like when it snowed in the command center and nobody cared. Uh, also, also, this is 60s technology, okay, which will, but futuristic technology, it does not survive of a cold-ass winter. Hey, I don't give a damn about the commander's feels right now. The needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few. Shut up, I'm talking. Oh, his own his own people just called Captain out. Oof. Yep. I'll get Kurt Russell, Keith David, Wilford Brimley, and we'll all get out of here. Diabetes. I told you not to eat all that bacon before getting to work. <laughs> Who am I? Where are you? <laughs> if I've been drinking. Tremors. Well, we don't need graboids. Uh, We're in worse. Okay. Graboids now? We don't need graboids here. We're in enough trouble. Right? We don't. We do not need Jacksonville Jaguars levels of fucked. Okay, Maddie, you'll appreciate this, and this will this uh, this will absolve you from the wrestling jokes. Well, still they're fighting better than the Paul brothers. Ooh, <laughs> ooh, Whoa. laser breath. Damn. I've heard of laser eyes and laser, but laser breath. That's a new one on me. Oh, he's going to snicker snag him. Ew. He's almost there. He's almost there. Well, now we know what to get Dan for Christmas. Glasses strap. Finally some warmth. <laughs> this reminds me of the time that uh, I forget who it was who made those glasses for you shades. And then I <laughs> forgot to uh, leave them with you. Or they were in there and I forgot. No and, combat uh, strength? Already in color timer. It's that fucking cold. Also with that spandex or whatever it is, alien, uh, whatever it is. Yeah. Shrinkage. Yeah. Ah, he he's, he's pulling a Superman. He's just got to charge up. Yeah. yeah. That's exactly what they said he's doing. He's dead! Abandon ship! I'm not giving this guy mouth to mouth. You load 16 tons. What do you get? Another day older and deeper in debt. You guys get a word of that? We're out of coffee! No! If it was red for him, then it would be different. Look, we're getting out of this base, or I'm going to have my foot stuck in your ass. Yeah. Goo-hoo! That's good solar energy. <laughs> world's and world's just, going to shit. He's up there getting his fucking tan. Yeah, he just ran into Superman charging up his solar flare in there. Yeah, they have to shoot the shit for a little bit. Yeah. So, you charging up too? Yep. Gonna whoop Goku's ass again. <laughs> Suck it, fanboys. Damn it! Damn it! 
Nana, MTV is on the air. Coming up, <laughs> Elton John, Cutting Crew, and Prince. And later on, Michael Jackson. Oh my God, the Umbrella Corporation. They're what? behind this. That explains everything. It does. Oh, oh. Hey, how many fingers am I holding up? (laughs) Is the monster asking daddy ass to scissor room? (laughs) Maybe. We got the kaiju version of Anthony Bowens. I don't know. With those giant lips, kind of looks like an alien Julia Roberts. Oof. Like a baboon's ass on its face. Actually, it looks like you know that female Muppet in the in the band. I forget what it's called. Her it kind of looks like her. Fair. Ah, can't, I'm blanking on her name, but you guys know what I'm talking about. Thank you, Sayla. Janice, Janice from the Muppets. Ah. The, the one with the blonde hair and the big lips. That's who it reminds me of. Oh, you can fly? So can I. Da 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 da. Lame. Bum bum. bum. Lame bum, lame. Bum. Fortunately, we have our soundtrack or on eight track. <laughs> He's throwing a hissy fit. I want to fly. I want, I want, I want, I want, I want to. Miss me? Uh, Damn. The fuck what was he that? Do? What did he do? <laughs> did he just like do a psychic it's... slam or something? Oh. Oh. oh! 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 Decapitation. Oh! Decapitation. Chopped him up oh. into bits. I thought we were watching we'll give Ultra the man Se- a hand. I thought we were watching Ultra 7, not Kamen Rider Amazon. Jesus. We refuse to lose. Whoops, our bad. Uh, That severed head begs to differ. Are they speaking um, to him telepathically or? Keep talking, bitch. That's more time for me to find you a whoopy all ass. So basically, they're, 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 they're all this. We found your weakness, so we will kill you. Ah, here's Ooh. something you don't see every day. The rare reverse transformation. Yeah, yeah, I'm done here anyway. Don't put me in there. It stinks! Could could you yell cut? I can't feel my goddamn legs. Please. Seriously. Pretty sure my feet are blue. He's... He's still wearing the uniforms. You poor bastard. And these things are not insulated. That's gotta fucking suck. Get the poor actors a a goddamn hot chocolate and a friggin' hot bath. Get him a space blanket. The ones they sell at Sharper Image. For fuck's sakes, man. man. They were gonna pick him up, but then he decided to walk off and look badass. Well, we tried. We tried. Anyway, let's go ahead. Well, and we'll up. have to just wait till next time to see what happens. Oh, no wait! wait. <laughs> <laughs> also, I need to make a minor adjustment over here. Damn. <laughs> Did you see that? Ultra 7 killed a guy. Lopped his head off. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh, oh with his head. Damn. Man. When I get to Ultra 7 and Ultra Spectacus, the highlight reels are going to be short. (laughs) It's literally one video of him chopping someone's head off and going, three episodes, uh, one out of three episodes, that happens. (laughs) 
That's all you need to know. Ultra 7, murder, death, kill. Murder, yeah. murder, death, kill. Basically. <laughs> Can't really explain. Cut the Being demolition, a... man, really. Yeah. By the way, folks, part three just rendered today, so expect it um, on Patreon soon if, you, if you're a patron. And if you're not, why not? But you'll see it on YouTube and tokutai.me soon enough. Moving on. Moving on. All right. So I hope everyone had a chance to get their second episodes loaded up and ready to go. So let's go one more time. Like I said, we're rolling double sevens tonight, ladies and gentlemen. So let's keep it going. Ultra 7, episode 26, Super Weapon R1. In three, two, one, lay. Wait a minute. Rescue Force is in this? Right? I heard R1 and I thought, wait a minute. Yeah, right? I'm like, wait a minute. Are we a little early for Rescue <laughs> Force? Like, wasn't that the 90s or like the early 2000s? Or maybe early it's 2000s, a, last time I checked. Or maybe if it's a super wet, maybe if it's R1, maybe it's the, uh, maybe it's uh, R2-D2's dad. <laughs> super weapon R1. Well, at least it's not Mega Weapon from Warrior of the Lost World. Super Weapon R1, so the prototype to the Death Star? Maybe. Kept blowing up every time you even try to turn the fucker on? By Super Weapon, they means that it's easily destroyable. Yeah, you know that's coming. Come on. We know how this oh, shit works. Yeah. All I'm going to say this time, Seven, is try not to lop its head off. Again? Wait, would that even work on a on a on what I'm assuming is a robot? Well, we'll see. Also, I feel bad for all the little Japanese kids who tried to make paper airplanes of these ultra vehicles, and they never quite <sighs> turned out the way they wanted. A lot of paper was wasted trying to do that. Yep. Yeah. Then again, it's hard to make a good paper airplane these days. Do kids even use paper airplanes anymore? I imagine they'd have their faces all buried in a smartphone. Oh, here we go. So, everybody at NORAD called in sick today? Professor Mano, Mano stands of fate. <laughs> I was going to ask, is it, is it, is it, is this looks, yeah, this is a rocket, but give it a couple of hands. That's, that's a flying robot right there. Where's Johnny Sacco? Oh, oh yeah. Well, it doesn't have the George Washington hair. Thank God. <laughs> yeah. 88,000 hydrogen bombs for fuck's sake. I thought, damn. Was, and I thought we Americans were overcompensating with nukes. They nuked us right back. So this is to blow up an alien planet. So Joe Bob was right. All right, they're different. Let's kill them. Airtight logic. So it's to stop an alien invasion, your idea is to blow up their planet? Isn't that like going after a fly with a bazooka? Yeah, I think I think Dad's got the right idea. Like, this isn't right. Something's wrong with and, this. And that's from the murderer. That And that's from the ultra murderer here. Yeah, he, he literally just went, are you sure about that? Yeah, and that yeah, and that's him talking. That's that's him saying that the guy who just lopped off an alien's head, well, not literally and one episode arms, ago, and arms. Uh, yeah. Hey, let me go. I got glasses. I have glasses. Hey, hands off the threads. Oh no, we were just uh, rehearsing a play. Do you please get your hands off me? I'm feeling funny. We're the government. We can make as many super weapons as we want. You talk about an arms race. You, you realize how that never works, right? Isn't this right off the heels of the Cuban Missile Crisis? 
Around that time, yeah. And I believe the world was still at war with the Soviet Union, so... Yeah... On a scale of 1 to 10, my boy, you're fucked. R2, building R2, R2-D2. Beep, boop, boop. Oh, oh dear. Oh, I hope you don't mind my little friend R2 joins the fight. Whoa, 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 whoa. They're going to make an even stronger one? <laughs> Are you sure this isn't the American government? Are you sure? Yeah, Donald, I'm starting to sure? question. At Are this you point? sure Donald Rumsfeld isn't running the scene here? Isn't running the show here? Or or uh, Colin Powell? This seems like something he'd do. Dick Cheney and Colin Powell, right? Someone Ultra Seven's about to fuck someone in the ass. Hey, we already got a super weapon around here. Me, <laughs> and I chop people's heads off with my giant fin. So they say they found a planet with no life on it. How much you want to bet there is? Yeah. It's a toku. It's a toku. Darn, if only we had some alien here who could scope out the planet. Hmm. Boring. Ba -da -da -da. Da -da oh, shit. I, I should probably stop before it costs us $50,000. Hey, we were supposed to launch this thing, not set it on fire. I mean... Wait, wait. Wrong target! Jesus! That rocket had what had that rocket had two days to retirement, you bastards! I hope that was nowhere near the Earth. Otherwise, they're gonna have a shit ton of meteors falling to Earth. How much you want to bet that, that 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 planet has regenerative abilities of a T one thousand? And I'm sure no aliens had that was no aliens' home planet, and they're not going to hear come here looking for revenge, right? Give it five minutes. Oh, he just realized he bought a timeshare on that planet. Well, it's not the Boston Marathon. What the fuck? Ah, oh, here we go. Oh, who could have foreseen this? Who couldn't see that coming? I'm telling you, that parrot, that planet's 10,000 Robert Patrick's liquid metal. Didn't we just blow that planet up? It got better. I say this with no joke. I say this with no humor. We fucked up. That you know of. It looked empty when we when we scanned it. Uh, is it too late to pin this on the Soviets? Maybe it was just the insurance adjuster making sure the planet didn't blow itself up to collect the insurance. Again. 
Oh, sorry, I can't get the Macarena song out of my head. Poor bastard. Yeah. Oh, he doesn't look mad. No, not at all. No, not at all. No, he's the picture of calm right there. A giant creature from outer space? That's eh, a bit of a stretch for this show. That is one pissed off bird. Yeah. Well, it did kind of blow up its nest, apparently. Uh, yeah. So this is where Q the Wing Serpent came from. Ugh, we are so screwed. No, that's that's the picture of Braun Strowman, who is the picture of uh, of Tom. Oh! Apparently, this bird is made of adamantium. Adamantium rage. Sorry, I I, I kind of had to on that one. Yeah. We're dealing with aliens. They don't conform to your rules. Also, we were going to blow up planet Venus, but Marvin the Martian was going to beat us to it. Oh, I'm going to blow it up. Where's the kaboom? There was supposed to be an earth-shattering kaboom. Yeah, blow up Venus, and and, and there's Minako Aino going, the fuck? <laughs> it's bad enough when Piccolo blew up the moon. <laughs> Big Bird is back, and he's pissed. This is for Snuffy! Oh, hey, John, you're gonna get this. Big Bird, starring Travis Willingham. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Big Bird really took it, took the, took the loss of Snuffy hard. Yeah. It's okay, What Bird. is this thing doing? Doing the I'm... jig? Seriously. Yeah, apparently, yeah, 90% of the monsters in the show we've watched so far have been doing dancing. Today. Just just today. I'm dancing, Dad. I'm dancing. Look at me. Stop it. That was great, but maybe we could drop some missiles where the monster is next time. There we oh, go. There you go. There you go. Mm. 10% Amen. accuracy. You're government at work, folks. Oh, look, a graveyard. Get it? Get it? Can we drive the subtlety home a little bit for you? About as subtle as the 20 milliliters of rain we got today. I'm starting to think Ultraman Ace is in the show that fucked up Hideaki Anno's childhood. Pretty sure it's not the only one at this point. There's no way it died that easily. It got blown up by fucking bombs from Earth. We know this shit the, doesn't work. The thing cut a meteor right in half just by launching into it. Yeah. Well, time Damn. to blow up another planet. Wait, R3 and R4? How many planets do you need to blow up, man? Jesus Christ. Oh, it's a full aspirin out tonight. So, you see the planet get blown up. And a monster comes from it. And you want to make more of that. <laughs> I knew the government are was you sure more. this isn't America? This is something we would do. This is something I expect from us, not Japan. I, I knew the government were full of idiots, but my God, I didn't think even you would be that stupid. The offensive strategy of the Cleveland Browns is more effective than this. For fuck's sake. Wow. Pretty sure old crazy Ronnie Reagan would be like, well, this is just a little too fucked up for me. <laughs> <laughs> you do that way too well, you know that? God bless you, Ronnie. 
<laughs> just just lay back, Mr. Reagan. Tell me about these dreams you're having. Well, in my dreams, I'm president of the United States. Yeah, incurable. <laughs> <laughs> This has been the monster flailing around and flying. That ate up some screen time. We have big trouble in little China. Space is here, Mr. Burton. Or we could just wait to, for Ultra 7 to save our bacon for the 20th time. But now nah, let's go drop, let's go drop some more bombs on it. Yeah, let's nuke two more fucking planets. Yeah. Let's drop some more bombs on the monster of the week. Hmm, let's see. We've tried that about 20 times this episode, but who's oh counting? Oh, God. No, it's worse. It's the offensive strategy of the Toronto Maple Leafs. All that money still don't get past the first fucking round. Yep. Right, oh, it's pretty, but it'll just piss you off. Then we need to call in Maverick and Iceman. What about Goose? Goose can go to hell. <laughs> Oh, I see. You blow up my planet, and I'm the bad guy here. You know how crazy that logic is? Also, uh, did the monster walk all the way to Holland? Looks like Denmark, though. Jesus! Christ! i just like to point out here that they're blasting at someone whose house they blew up! Yeah, I'm with Gardner. Jesus, Reptilicus had more respect. No kidding! Yongari had more respect than this. Pretty sure Godzilla and Gamera are, ba are, are backstage sipping lattes going, Dude, this is pretty fucked up right here. Yeah. <laughs> And they were pretty, and they were pretty much made by nukes. Hey, camera, stop eating the popcorn. Have some fucking respect. Yep. But it's car crash television. I can't stop staring. It's at that point. It's at that moment the scientists knew they fucked up. We got the most nuclear version of keeping it real going wrong. They should just ask themselves, what would Radioactive Man do? Run! Up and at him! Up and at them! Up and at him! Up and at them! Up and at him! Up and at them! <sighs> Better. So your solution to destroying a monster made of the radioactivity from the first bomb is to throw another one of them at him! My God, did I shoot these people in the balls? Where did you get your PhD? In the back of a Cracker Jack box? Seriously, I think Talk it needs to be revoked. No, they, they, no they I, I take that back. That's an insult to Cracker Jack prizes. They got it from the box of kitty cereal. That's an insult to kitty cereal. They probably got their PhDs off the back of a dog food can. Oh, God. <laughs> I'd say something about 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 June and, and and her dog food, but she eats kibble. Hey, there's a good one, Gardner. Up and at him, at him, and he'd know what nice. to do. Nice. Crap, 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 crap. We did not think this through. D ladies and gentlemen, the, the description of this episode right there. We did not think this shit through. Also, do you have the Barrett button shades? Because this whole episode can be summed up in yes, that one button. Yes! Give me two seconds. Take your time. We're hourly. Here we go. Oh, you ah! All right, I'll clean up your mess again. 
All right, I let you suffer it enough, folks. I'll fucking fix it for you. Also, I'm like, should we feel something for these guys? I mean, this is pretty much all on them. This is all their fault. They fucked this up. Yep. I mean, yes, they need to protect their planet from the from the, all these alien invaders, but using nukes never fucking works. Oh, he's flashing him. Ew. Oh, well, that's not that trick's not gonna work this time. See what I tell you, adamantium. If it didn't work the first time, why the hell would it work the next ten times? It's like shooting a Dominic Hatchet. I think the stupidity's rubbing off on freaking Dan over here. Yeah. It's it's it's, it's there it's it's the radio activity. Yeah. This thing's like kill, trying to kill a death claw and fall out with a pipe gun. Won't anyone give me a hug? <laughs> Ring around the die. Oh, oh, this is the big one. I'm coming, Elizabeth. Oh, oh. Must not spank. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, this what? is a little something for the ladies. But I like it too. What, did he suddenly just get a can of spinach or something and turn it into Popeye? <laughs> yeah, the, right? the soundtrack makes it sound like that, right? Yeah, that's okay. right. Between the muscle <laughs> flexing <laughs> and the music, <laughs> that's <laughs> the first <laughs> thing that came to my mind was fucking Popeye. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh, come on! Oh, come on! You can't do that! How are you able to do that? My heroic theme music kicked in. Ah, tis but a scratch. A scratch, your arm's off. No, no it, it isn't, isn't, you liar. He beat him the in his own freaking way. You, you sick fuck. You sick fuck. You he literally tore fuck. off his arm and beat him with it. Jesus. You sick fuck. You sick fuck. You sick fuck. Looks like he got ultra swole. <laughs> oh, oh, no, no, no. The other one. The other one. No. Oh. God. Looks like he's about to be armless and harmless. Oh! Right slit his throat! throat! Dude! Oh. Slit his throat! Damn! We keep saying this is why you don't piss off Dan Morboshi. This is why, fucking Christ! Give my nest to Mr. Hooper. Now I understand no, why the old, wow. why the old, why uh, Dan Morboshi of the Ultraman anime was such an asshole. Right? It all makes sense now. Uh, yeah. Dan, don't fuck around. We tampered in God's domain. You know, under more extraneous circumstances, I'm pretty sure you two would be facing a court-martial for this. Followed by a hefty fine and several years in a maximum security facility. <laughs> the giant silver guys got this, by the way. Wait, wait, wait. He was exposed to radiation and nobody's putting the dots together? Nobody's connecting the dots? Can't believe I'm about to hit the bad cops button on this on this on these guys. Jesus, right? Like I know they're not cops, but close enough, folks. I'm starting to think we should have sent Ultra 7 after the, the the Titans in an attack on Titan. He could have handled all those fuckers in one minute. Even that yeah, big metallic right? one. Now that's that would be a good death battle, actually. Just pit Ultra 7 against all the Titans. Hmm. You... You've given me a lot to think about.
Hello, Commander. Hello, murderer. Genocider. Jesus, even the squirrels want to get the fuck out. Yep. Yeah, we're going to do some huge military weaseling out of this situation. Was I talking to you, killer? Just don't let it happen again, okay? Okay. Next time, Ultra 7 won't save your ass. How do you know? Yeah. Um, I just know. Hey, got any cashews? I'm starving here. Well. Snap, <laughs> Damn, I haven't pulled that button out in God knows how long. Yep. I get it. The squirrel trapped on the wheel is an is a is a um is an um, is an um, anachronism for uh or a or um analogy for uh people trying to create nuclear arms in a bid to for, for world supremacy. Or it could just be that Dan is the only sane person, and he's the squirrel in the nut house. <laughs> Either way, the answer is fuck. Jesus. Yeah. Tap dancing Christ. Wow. Back to form with Ultra 7. Jesus. No Christ. shit. My God. Is, ugh. You know, I don't say this often, Toku Faithful. I'm not much for censorship in Toku, but I'm trying to think this episode, this episode should have been banned, too. Yeah, like like I said, between these two episodes, were we, are we sure we were watching Ultra Seven and not Common Rider Amazon? And I don't oh, mean shit. Amazons; I mean the original. Yeah, although that one was pretty brutal too. But yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. But uh, oof, just just looking at that, I'm looking at at Ultra Seven and looking at Ultraman Zero. How come you're not nearly as half bad, half as badass as your daddy there? Yeah, it, it, how? Ultra 7, ba most badass motherfucking Ultra in the entire franchise, and then we have Zero, the biggest pussy in the Ultra universe. Yeah. It's, how did literally, he... it's literally I... Ken Titus and Christopher Titus. Wussy! <laughs> yeah, we, we got an Ultra, we have another anti-dad. No, no, not Ken Ti not Christopher Titus, fucking Dave Titus. Definitely. <laughs> And I'm not the Titus fan, and even I know this much. Yeah, that's 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 unfair. That's more fair. That's, yeah. <laughs> nah. Nah. In this case, the dad is cooler than the son. Yeah. If anything, it's a, if anything, and fans of the show will get this. If anything, it's more like Johnny Lawrence and Robbie Keane. Johnny's a badass, and his son Robbie's a bit of a softy. Yeah. Pretty much. No, it's simple. How did it? How how did uh, seven wind up with zero? Karma. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, I think it's time we move on. So, Maddie. Yeah. What fucking time is it? We don't sit the fuck down. I'll fucking tell you, bud. <laughs> <laughs> Folks. Uh, I, I I no jokes here. It's, it's a simple matter. I just saw. Kevin Director's cosplaying music video for Power Morphicon. I knew that they would come where I'd be like, ah, fuck, I regret not going to Morphicon this year. And that was it. It's two years, right? Two years from now? Yep. Yeah. I'm fucking going in, in 2024. God willing, all three of us will be there. Hell or high water, I'm going there. I don't care if I cosplay or not. I'm going to be in that fucking crowd in goddamn Pasadena. And hopefully they'll be. They'll, hopefully we we'll get to meet the the the, the Dino Fury actors. They were awesome. We should thank them. It's me, McClock. Also, that would be by the time we get to twenty twenty four, there'll be the Cosmo Fury actors. True. True. Eh, true. Six and one. Six yeah. and one. Six and one. But yeah. yeah. 
Also, yeah, Maddie, it would have been nice if you were there to catch me when I fainted after meeting Liana. Right? <laughs> I hopefully sure I, knew, hopefully I, I won't have that problem again. Hopefully I won't have that problem again come Ranger Stop. Yeah, I, I, I will be there. Now, <laughs> we the, trick, there. Though, Herif, the, the trick, though, is you have to fall backwards like you did in Morphicon. You cannot flare flop on me, okay? No, Don't no. worry. That's why I'll be near the. Fr- I'll be pretty much in front of him, just just in case. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, for the last hour, we've been the ones trying to make you laugh. Now it's your turn to try to make us laugh. It's time for Toku Memes Live. Ah, uh, so we got. I think it was tw- uh, was twelve memes. I believe tonight. No, eleven memes tonight. However. No. Uh oh. Do I hear two? Who screwed what? up? We had one, one type. Well, it's more of a mis, wrong use, wrong word. Um, they were going for okay. one word, use the wrong version. Ah. Uh, Is that one of those there, there kind of situations? Oh, you hit the nail on the head, sir. Uh, it's exactly that. Well, all I can say to the guilty party is fix it and bring it back to us. Well, no, no, we don't skip those. No, it's literally it's 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 typo. No botch award is reviews, and we, you know, button yeah. denied. Beyond that, we we give it the respect it deserves. Yeah, come yeah. on. Yeah, we're not Satan here. No, no. Regardless. Let us go ahead and get our memes underway. Courtesy of our first meme here from Cure Crystal. Hey, <laughs> you're copying me. I, at least I respect people's privacy. At least I didn't doom the world. Oh, oh son, now. Woo! That is... Right out the gate, Cure being savage, yeah. Damn, Cure, nice, savage. Yeah, yeah. Let, let me get that button prepped for you here. Oh yeah. Woo, yes sir, yes sir. Yes sir, that is proper savage. That is proper put down. Slim Jim's all over, uh huh. And, and, and really good use of, the, of Death Note in this case. Yeah, one letter names. Both of them are super geniuses. Both of them are a little crazy. <laughs> At least Dr. K wears shoes. Yes. Yeah, very true. Yep. Still, good job, Cure. Good job. I approve. And Dr. K wasn't replaced by some asshat who will remain nameless. Uh, uh, oh, fuck. John yeah. knows exactly what I speak. Oh, yeah, considering this was the very first anime I ever reviewed, for those of you who don't know my history. <sighs> I will never forgive them for that. No, because, neither will I. Because, yeah, because I was liking the show till then. Mm. I think that's most fans. Anyway, nicely done, Kira. Moving on. Next, we got Brony Ranger. All right, kiddo, I think that's enough playing outside. Time to come on in. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Oh, fuck. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> wow. Wow. Took me a minute to realize what that was, but oh, fuck. Wow. He was frozen today. <laughs> yeah. See, also, only... I just, I just realized, just got that. Yeah, no, and, and this is the one time that joke applies, considering who else is in this GIF. Yeah. Yeah. I can't even be mad for you making that reference, because he's the one that started the fucking thing. Yeah. The, yeah. The less said, the better, is all I'm going to say. Yeah, I kind of gonna have to deduct a couple points for using him, because quite frankly, he's on our shit list these days. If you don't have anything nice to say about a person, don't say anything at all. Is what my saving mom said, and we'll leave it at that. <laughs> indeed, yeah, indeed. If you don't know, look it up. <laughs> anyway, regardless, nicely done, Brony Ranger. Moving on. Mom is up. Golf clap. Next, we got guts. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh, God. Oh, I need to do this. I need to do this because I'm the only one close to Shin that could probably do this. All right, take it. Hey, Gal Bison. 
How you been? So you see Jai, what's that like? You come legs, a giant robot, right? Nearly lost the use of my legs by a car accident. Say hi to your mother for me, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Shout out. Guts obviously listens to, to my show. <laughs> <laughs> Send me a picture of that. We need to, we need we need Shin to read that. The thumb is up. I will send that to you during the during intermission. That okay. Also, uh, you 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 butter me up button because it's obviously that. Oh, fuck! I gotta get that. I gotta get that. I, all my buttons got reset again. Fuck you all. Oh. Fuck you, Windows. But I've got it right here. Don't try and butter me up. And if it's not been called in the chat, button. Nope, not even close. What's yours, Batty? <laughs> One. This contest is over. Give that man the ten thousand dollars. We had one call in the chat. One person called for a button. That was it. So yeah, that one's yours. Just <laughs> because literally Daniel Garcia in in, in the run with the uh, the 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 JAS has become. <laughs> I mean, Shin will Shin will I refuse to acknowledge it, but it's a Marky Mark impression. Oh fuck! And a oh, damn undeniably, beautiful. undeniably. Are you looking at the and, fucking hat? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> now I'm just waiting for him to do his impression of of his, his performance in the happening. <laughs> what, ma'am? No, no not, not the, the wind. wind. Not the wind. <laughs> what? What? No. I think we. I think we made that joke on the Russell Cast. I would not be surprised, sir. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, congratulations, sir. Moving on. Next, we got DJ. Oh God. Okay, me. Keep the Q man, supreme ruler of Century Zen. What was that? I'm sorry, Lord Rao. It was a slip of the tongue. Please don't make me explode. Fine. I have something else in mind. Keith the Q-Man was later seen stuffed and mounted on Rao's wall. Ah! All oh, right. All right. Okay. Harsh. Fair. Small chuckle, but... Uh, a giggle. Uh, a giggle. Yeah. Reference is just a little too obscure for us on this one. Kind of... I need to watch Revice. I just I don't know why it came up to me, but I just I need to watch that now. Yes, you do. Actually, I need to finish it and start. I haven't even started on the new guy yet. That's how far behind I am. Oh shit! Yeah. But let's not let's not bring modern Toku into this. Not yet. Not bad there, DJ. Good effort. Have some steak. Moving on. Yes. Next, we got KR thirty six. If you don't call it, I will. Go, go ahead. All right, I'm Do taking it. this one. <laughs> this contest is over. Wow. Give that man the ten thousand dollars. And the chat's been cock blocked. Oh, you almost had it. You have to be quicker than that. Just a, literally one away, and they want to call it. Oh, too late, hey, folks. Hey. Too late. Right, guys, want to know how I can make it funnier? Uh, Even, 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 that's all, folks. Good night, Porky. Go home, people. <laughs> it was uh, it was Batman Night on Toonami, and the intro was literally Daffy Duck bouncing around. And But right before the end of the animation, he gets yanked by Porky Pig. Yeah, uh, yeah I think we can officially call this meme of the week right here. All of us were cracking up on this one. Wow. Yeah. That is so fucking perfect. It's Nothing not beats the classics. <laughs> Simple but effective. <laughs> Bravo. Also, I believe this might have been a meme challenge. Yeah. Oh, fuck yeah. Yeah. KR36 with meme challenge complete and getting a button for it. That is a win, sir. Good for you. Someone's doing their homework around here.
Yeah, Ingrinico's confirming. Yeah, this was a meme challenge. Well, there you wow. go. Wow. <laughs> this is why we do challenge. these. We forgot it was a meme challenge. Well, to be fair, it's been over a month since we uh, saw this, so. It's, it's yeah. been a while. But. So, yeah. This is why we have. This is why we call the meme challenge and we see faces like this because if you use it right, you can make fucking magic, and KR just proved it. Yep. Meme faces, meme challenges, meme scenes. There's a reason why we call challenge. Yeah. Give us your best with these scenes, and my God, did you fucking succeed. Congratulations, KR36. Moving on. Next, we got Sayla. Hello, Doctor. We're investigating the results of Keeper messing with time. Have you noticed anything different? Not really. Let me ask my companion. Romana, have you noticed anything? No. <laughs> Oh. I get it. Where's what? my challenge? Oh my fucking god! Wow! Oh, there Button. it is. Easy's calling it. <laughs> this contest is over. Give that man the ten thousand dollars. Mike Shell, that one's for you, buddy. Oh, uh, and I'm not calling Button just because you used Time Force, but that did not hurt. <laughs> so, butter me up, Button. Denied. No, nope, denied. But still. No. Oh. It, oh. it's, it's definitely button worthy, Sayla. Oh, that's a shame because one of these Ramanas I really like, and the other one, ugh. Uh, still. Ugh, yeah. And you can't go wrong with Tom Baker. You really just can't. It's the classic. He's my second favorite classic doctor. Which was the first? Pertwee. Good call. No, hey, I'm a no shame man. there. Hey, I. Hey, I no love Baker. Don't here. get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. But Pertwee was the one that that real that introduced me to who. Hey, no, ah. there is nothing. I've got yeah. nothing bad to say about Pertwee. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Plus, Pertwee had the Brigadier. Best yeah. Male companion, best male companion ever. I'm pretty sure I'm not alone on that. <laughs> You're not getting any soul. disagreement from me, sir. <laughs> I miss I miss him. God uh. rest his soul. Mm -hmm. I, I saw the clips of his last appearance on the Sarah Jane Adventures. That was like, oh. That hurt. That that that, that, it that does. brought a tear to my eye. But yeah, bravo, Sayla, bravo. Bravo, Sayla, bravo. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you, you chose, you have chosen wisely. <laughs> Sayla saying because you figured these three would be the best. Uh, yeah, I think she, 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 I think she was smart about that one. Nicely done, Sayla. Congratulations. Moving on. Next, got Brother Ball. Oh, oh my God. Yes. Like the shed house and I'll be cast. God blew my load. We all did. Blew my load. Damn it. We all blew our fucking loads. Ah, yes. Shed house in here. Shed house in here. Also, whoever edited that Joker housing video, you are my fucking hero. Chef's kiss for that. That was fucking glorious. I saw that. That I'm, was awesome. I can't believe I got to meet this meet Dan Housen at the Jamboree. It was, uh, it was, I was cursed, but I was blessed. Yes. <laughs> hey, not all curses are outright curses. You know, he he's a comedy guy. Sometimes it's um, comedy curse. Gentlemen, oh, oh. ladies and gentlemen, the chat has spoken. <laughs> this contest is over. Give that man the ten thousand dollars. Oldie but a goodie on the shirt too. Yeah. Yes. New oh, twist on an old classic. Someone's been watching Build. Good timing too, because they're re-releasing all the Build stuff in America, no less. Yeah, and of course Dan oh. Housen pretty hot right now. I mean, he just had a match on Friday, so good time to pull him yep. out of the. Yeah, I should. I meant to ask him this, Jambri. Are you and Hook still like a thing? Because <laughs> I haven't seen them around in a while. He's he's been hanging out with the uh, best friends, which is, I'm not against, but I just I liked Hookhausen. Uh, I think we all did, but yeah, it, Hook's got other things to worry about right now. But yeah, before we move yeah. on, ladies and gentlemen, it's time. Warning! Warning! The emergency 10k button has now been armed. A call of seven votes from the chat, along with agreement from the hosts, will activate the button. It has been a while. Holy crap. And we've got three we got four memes left after this. We so, may have a chance. 
it's been a it's been a hot minute since we've been here. And with how, how hot the chat, the, the, how hot our fans have been with memes tonight, there's a strong chance we might get the emergency button tonight. Okay, well let's not get ahead of ourselves. Remember the rules, uh, boys and girls. Don't force it. Yeah. We don't want we don't want a titter. We don't want a snicker. We want to roar with unabashed laughter. We got four chances at it, folks. Yes. Yes. So we, don't, we got to don't string a bunch of obscenities together and tell us that's funny. Only Jack Nicholson and Jack Warden can do that. Yeah. Basically, always like I've always said, watch us. If we're cracking up, go for it. If we're if we're busting out laughing like we did with that Looney Tunes meme earlier, call it. Because odds are good that's gonna get it. Don't think it, feel it, feel and it. don't give a don't don't uh, don't give us a pity. But don't give a pity button either. You yeah. gotta feel. Don't think it, feel you gotta it. Gotta earn. It's gotta earn it. It's gotta fucking yeah. earn it. Anyway, so by the ball, congratulations, nicely done. Moving on. Next got JMC. Bring bring. Hello. <laughs> Wrong number. <laughs> not bad. Not bad. Funny. Oh, yeah. Cool. Cool. A giggle. A giggle. Yeah. <laughs> hey, it's a good one, though. Oh, yes. Yes. Though, if you're going to use the FNAF meme, which, I can't, by the way, I'm going to have to send this to Jaina now. <laughs> yes. Uh -oh. but if you're going to do that, you have to have, instead of it saying uncomprehensible demon speech, just have the song, just have, like, the name of the song there. Cause yeah, like that on that's that's. Oh, I just noticed the Freddy Fazbear on the. Side. I recognize that yeah. shot anywhere. Yeah, yeah. It took me a minute. Also, I see you leaving your watermarks on the side. You gotta crop that shit out. Yeah, just a little little constructive. Yeah, gotta be careful with that. By the way, JMC it was it was nice meeting you at Morphicon. Good nice. work. Indeed. Good, good work. It's always great meeting you guys in person. Yep. So not bad there, JMC. Nicely done. Moving on. Next got retro kit. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. here we go. Here we go. I knew this This was inevitable. This was inevitable. Female comradeers explaining their details in excruciating detail. Every yellow, pink, and even a few female six sentai ranger hearing this. <laughs> <laughs> you know? It's been, that meme has been floating around. It's the meme L of the month. Lie.exe not found. Yeah. yeah. I keep going back to that last meme. I'm like, replace the FNAF with with Wadna from from Critical Role. Yeah. Okay, Maddie. That'd be a uh, uh, that'd uh, be a good uh, chuckle too. Also, this meme. Let me just analyze that. No lies detected. Yeah. Yeah. I mean. Yeah. No, oh, no, no lies. Yeah. Lie.exe not found. <laughs> So I have that button. Still Where's... nice, nicely done, retro kid. Moving on. Next, we got Aka Red Rob Ranger. Um, uh, are we supposed to get this? I got nothing. I have a sus sneaky suspicion. I know what that second image is from, but no. Yeah, no. Yeah, I got nothing. I mean, yeah, no, I got nothing. YGM, I had a feeling. Yeah, Owl House. I had uh, a feeling it was Owl House. Never neither, saw it. Neither have I. I know it's popular. I know a lot of people love it. Never got a chance to see it. Yeah. Not, not on my to-do list. No, okay. Meme face on, on a meme face. I mean, I get, yeah, oh. I get it. Good effort, have some steak. Pretty much. Yeah. Pretty much. All right, last chance. Last chance. Can we get it? Can we get a winner at the end? Let's find out. Last beam of the night goes to Evan Hunter Gale. Me after seeing how many common writers and other Toku actors are in the Yakuza series. Uh. Where's the joke? I think it's the whole idea that his mind's blown. Uh, that's not really a joke. That's a fact. Yeah. Uh, uh, I mean, fair. It, 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 I mean, it's that's a, a that's a, that's not that's that's more of a the more you the more you know. But 
Yeah. Unless the unless it's the, the the unless it's something in the second panel, and I'm I can't make it. I'm not recognizing the face. Neither am I. I was trying to figure out who that is. Hold on. Though I'm sure the chat's gonna have an let me answer. Let put my let me put my blue blockers on. It's not coming to me. Give me two seconds. I'm gonna pull up my thing on a uh, Google Drive. Yeah. And, uh, again, we might, yeah, again, lie.exe not found. Oh, and of course, mm -hmm. 700 Gale didn't even tell us who that is. It just says he's been playing a lot of Yakuza right lately. So I don't even know which Toku actor that is. Is well, that the Toku actor? I would assume it is, otherwise he would have, if, if he... Well, he's in the chat. Evan, would you like to enlighten us? Yeah. Also, in the meantime, as far as this goes, all the hopes and dreams of us getting the emergency button. It's fucking close, folks. Close, close, but no cigar. I, there, there's not even one that I could even consider giving a pity button to. Like it's, it's nah. Sometimes if it's at least funny enough, maybe I'll give it to it. Not this time. None of them even came close. Yuki Sato is what he say, is saying. Oh, Kagami from Kabuto. Aha! Ah, uh, oh, now I see it. Now okay, I see it. I, I qual all right, that will qualify. I'm used that. to him having his. I'm used to him having his hair down, not not up. Yeah, the so. the teeth can only give away so much. Uh, yeah. <laughs> his smile only gives us so much to work with here. Well, at least he's getting work. You know. That's true. That is very. To be true. fair, Kagami is my favorite character in Kabuto, and as we saw in Geo. He finally got some closure, so yeah, you know, good on him. You know, again, and uh, this is an interesting factory. It's good to see Toku actors getting work, even if it's just voice work. Indeed, indeed. Anyway, regardless, that, ladies and gentlemen, is our Toku memes live for tonight. Uh, so close, so close. Not even, not even. Oh, indeed. thank you for joining us, Coops. Ah, hi, Coops. <laughs> Coop's a little late to the party. The birthday boy probably is having a little bit of birthday fun. Hey, hey, you're only you're hey, you're only thirty once. Enjoy it. Pretty much. For those but, but, for the rest yeah, of you. Uh, oh, sorry. We almost had a clean sweep, Coops. Go easy on them. Go That's easy on them. Regardless, for the rest of you, if you want to send your memes in for next time after the show ends tonight, you can find the submission form in the about section below, or type in exclamation point memes in the Twitch chat to pull up the link there as well. Rules are on the screen. JPEG, PNG, or GIF files only. No spoilers. If you're watching the episode this week, even if we watched it earlier in the evening, it is still considered spoiler territory. Does not require a Toku scene, but does require a Toku reference. One meme per submission. And remember that all memes must be submitted by 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, the day of the show. And with that, we're going to go to an ad break. We're going to take a few minutes, get your drinks, get your snacks, get your bathroom breaks in, whatever you need to do. And we'll be back to talk a little bit, answer a few Q's and A's and all that jazz. But for that, we will leave you once again with the words of Lord Alfred Hayes. And we will see you guys soon.
And we are back, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, real quick, before we go uh, go on, big shout out to everyone who's been supporting me in my new voice acting work with the Lab 316 dubs. Uh, yeah, been getting a whole bunch of new episodes, and uh, I've got some new projects on that regard in the works. And uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to share these in the Discord server because they are not for the faint of heart. Just in time for Halloween. <laughs> uh -huh. Pretty much. Like, th these are the kind of things that unless you have a strong stomach, you will not be able to watch them. They're, they're that tough. They're that, they're, they're <laughs> that level of brutal. Sounds like a night on the last drive-in, right, Maddie? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, these yeah. Would be, yeah th this is the kind of stuff that probably make you smile because of just how gruesome they can get. As long as it's got the three Bs, I'm happy. Uh, it's probably missing one of them. Yep. After after that meme that after that meme we uh we all cracked up at. For some reason, I was craving carrots. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Doc? <laughs> Yeah, I, I will be putting the disclaimer. If I do put that particular manga dub on the bot, I will have a disclaimer for every episode because, yeah. But regardless, the rest of the manga dubs are, thank you guys so much for all the support on that and all the love. And yeah, it's been building up a lot of my confidence. I'm actually auditioning for other projects outside of Lab 316. I'm actually trying to become a proper fucking voice actor now. I can't say what any of these projects are because obviously I haven't been casted yet. We're going to be asking him for a handout before long, Maddie. Uh, hey, that was my plan. My plan was <laughs> to pay, pay you guys back for all the times you bailed my ass out. <laughs> I don't want to be one of those fucking leeches, man. I hated it. I hate that. If anything, you should be paying Mike back. He's bailed us out more than anybody. Well, you damn right I'm going to be paying his ass back once I get We started. love you, Mike. But you've, you've saved our bacon more than once. <laughs> you just say the least. So yeah, that that's my goal with all this is to actually be able to have money to to share to to, to pay you guys back at least a little bit. God's sakes, you guys have been helpful to me all these years. But well. Regardless. Mm. And yeah, I do know some other projects are being worked on for Lab 316 that I'll have to add besides the ones I'm working on. There's a couple other mangas that I know are coming out soon, but they haven't been released yet. Though I'm keeping my eyes peeled. I will add them to the bot as soon as I see them. And if you haven't checked out the manga dubs yet, I, I have two channels located in, uh, in the Discord server with two new roles. One for manga dubs and one for the story time animation channels. Uh, both are which are really good. Uh, of course, tends on your taste. Story, the story time animation channels, the animations are pretty much all the same. Like, it uses the same animation style that I, I don't even know how to describe it because it's not something that's ever been touted as a big thing. It's not Flash. It's just like these kind of these. How do I even describe it? You, you have to see it for yourself. But they all use the same exact style of animation. They don't use, like, hand-drawn stuff or anything like that. In fact, like, there's, like, a dozen... It's, like, some kind of pre-made setup kind of thing that, like, a dozen channels are using outside of Lab 316. Both America and Japan. Or maybe it's just a Japanese thing. I don't know. I'd have to look into that and find out what that animation is. But they're all yeah. the stories are pretty good. Uh, the manga dubs, of course, they all have their different artists and stuff like that. They here here's the big thing with Lab Three One Six. The they're just the company that's bringing them to other countries. They're not the ones making the mangas. They're just the ones. They're just basically a licensing group. They're just paying for it to get licensed and dubbed. They're not the ones producing the mangas themselves. So they're basically like the crunchy roll of manga dubs. That's the best way to describe it. Anyway, uh, 
any non-Power Rangers Toku news, because obviously we're going to save the Power Rangers stuff for a couple of weeks when Dino Fury comes back. Yep. Plenty to cover there, too. Oh, fuck. Um, well, we are getting more Sentai on DVD. Yeah. yeah uh, I don't know if we, that counts or not, but yeah, we'll definitely have to, um, we definitely want to bring that up. Yeah, Five Man and uh, Abba Ranger finally coming out. It's, you know, five man, who gives... Ma Sorry. And finally, millions of people will finally find out what Jasmine was doing in Decker Ranger with, with the Abba Ranger dance. <laughs> yeah, and of course, who gives two shits about five man? <laughs> oh, well, some people do. Oh, I'm sure it's got his fans, I'm... but it's considered like the worst sent one of the worst classic Sentai seasons for a reason. Yeah. It's not going to be a day one purchase for me, but I'll probably get it later. Actually, I'm looking at my, my Sentai DVD collection right now. Let's see. I've got everything but, uh, let's see. I need Mega Ranger, Go-Go 5, and I think Hurricaneger. And then, of course, the new ones, Five Man and Abba Ranger. Then I should be all caught up, but I need those others first before I, uh, I get Five Man. Yeah. Basically, in order for us to get to the really good stuff, we're going to have it for classic Sentai. We got to get through Five Man, and then we're going to eventually have to get through Turbo Ranger. But once we do that, then we get to the good shit. <laughs> oh. Oh. If we can keep this going long enough to get past Turbo Ranger and get one more, just one more after that, I think Easy will be a happy son of a bitch. Don't do that. Don't give me hope. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if we get past Abba Ranger and get a legit Decca Ranger release, I might have to go back and re-review it. Oh, God. Hell yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I don't mean going back and editing, um, editing the fan subs out and putting the official subs in, but I mean a re-review and going back, you know, I don't know if it'll be under the Toku time label because I still haven't heard back from Disco Tech about that. Honestly, I don't know if they're gonna they're gonna give me the time of day or not. But you know, well, until they send me a season to assist, I'm gonna keep using it. I mean, yeah. But um, yeah, I gotta ask that question a lot at Morphicon. People come up to me, it's like, "Hey, what's going on with them?" It's like, I wrote them. They haven't wrote ripped back. I haven't heard anything from them, so I'm just going to play this by ear. But anyway, you think moving on. Um, I'm sorry, go ahead. But uh, moving on from that, we do have some, um, some uh, well, depending on how you look at it, news about Black Sun coming to Amazon <laughs> Prime. So looks like it's time to get a Prime account, boys and girls. I've got mine. Same here. I mean... It makes sense. They've already have the. They probably are carrying on the deal they had from the Amazon from Amazon's. They're probably like Amazon's probably did just well enough for them to keep that deal alive. Hey, I'm just I'm just glad we're getting it. You know, getting it over here in some way, shape, or form. Mm -hmm. A retelling of Common Rider Black. Come on. Yep. Yep. And um, honestly, if things weren't going the way they were, you know, if if we're still doing this. We may cons we may have considered putting that on here, but big if. Well, there is still you guys can still do it on your version of to Toka Rift. You know, you guys were still talking about doing the Discord thing. We'll see. Yeah, for those who missed that announcement, with that little uh, announcement last time. Yeah, the plan going forward is we're gonna finish up the shows we're already doing here because that would be unfair to you guys if we didn't. And then I'm going to be stepping back from Toku Riffs. I need to focus on a lot of different things. So I'm passing the reins on to Maddie and Easy, who are going to be moving this over to the Discord server as a watch party format instead of doing uh, what we're doing now. We might. What I might do to help you guys out is because if we were to do this like an actual watch party like we do with the anime watch parties, you guys wouldn't be able to riff much with everybody watching um, – with everybody talking over each other, so no, 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 no. We're we're gonna make it. Uh, we're, we're gonna make it. You know, you know. Everybody has to keep their mics 
You didn't well, know that's camp, why video I was going to suggest yeah. the stage presentation feature of Discord for Toku. Yeah. Games. Well, that, that, that was, uh, yeah. That, that was way, only idea. you two have to be in the actual call. The rest can just join in and listen in and watch along. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were going to do a thing. Well, I had an idea, like, maybe we could uh, open it up once the uh, between episodes. We'll see. But again, this is all... This is all in the, in the early stages, and we still we and it, it's, we're probably gonna have a lot of discussions over the over the the week when we're together. Yeah, about how how we're gonna do it to, uh, logistically do it, but uh, yeah, yeah. The 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 primary idea is obviously the watch party format and doing like a podcast like show, putting together with 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 Ranger recap, but it's still in in the early stages of how that will work. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if we'll make it a podcast, but we'll definitely. It'll still be in the same vein as this on Toku. Yeah, it may not be a podcast, but it'll be in in the same vein as any of our live talk shows. Yeah, and uh, for those while you're wondering, I don't know if we're gonna bring in a new co-host or not. I mean, honestly, I don't know anybody who could replace John or Ace or even Mike. But uh, uh, we'll see. I mean, honestly, I don't think we know anybody who could run with us. <laughs> Be nice to get a female riffer in here for a change. I mean, Mystery Science Theater has a new female host, for those yeah. who haven't been paying attention. Yeah. Unfortunately, finding female common Rider fans... Yeah, I know. Diamond in the rough. <laughs> there, there's very few, and most of them have already been snatched up elsewhere. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're, the odds of finding another Ranger Liz are pretty slim. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> if anybody knows anybody who who, um, who um, has the has the riffing chops, please please point us in their direction. <laughs> and before anyone asks, we're probably not going to be taking requests from you guys just because. Be a bit much. Yeah. Anyway, we honestly we just want to do the stuff we want to do for a little while. Yeah. I mean, two two is. Um, Two is great, but riffing works better better in threes. Well, uh, we'll see. Maybe we'll have some guests on or something. But again, we're getting ahead of ourselves. Uh, any other? To oh, more token news. Shin Ultraman is coming to the states. I yeah. don't know where. I don't know when, but the the deal has been has been inked. I'm hoping it'll be something like Fathom Events, where they like they do with uh, riff tracks or or um, yeah. Shout Factory does with their movies. Where they uh, they they have it in select theaters and they put it in that one I like to go to, but um, we'll we'll see, or maybe even better the Alamo Draft House because I haven't been there since uh, since before COVID. That'd be interesting, yeah. All right, let me prep things up for. Actually, I think at this point we should probably move on to Q and A. Yeah, yeah, I a think, good call. Yeah. 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 All right, ladies and gentlemen, remember to make sure you use your channel points, the RVT points, located at the below your chat box, at the bottom of their chat box, to ask your questions. It is all open and available. And while they come in, I will set up the screen share for our next show coming up. Because I know you guys probably got a lot of Qs, so we've got a lot of A's. Yep. Send them in, folks. Yep. And and feel free to take your time this time because I'm not in a hurry for once. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think I'm joining tonight's Geek Watch, honestly. Uh, they're doing a uh, discussion between action RPGs and quote-unquote JRPGs. Yep. Oh, by the way, Maddie, I won't say what it is here, but cosplay uh, plans have changed at Ranger Stop. I'll tell you later after the show. Uh-oh. Will do. Folks, you'll just have to be there to see what it is. Or wait for the inevitable social media posts. <laughs> all right. All right. Oh, and there, there we go. I, I, ah! I was going to say. <laughs> don't all speak at once. Um, here's the thing, Cyber, uh, Cyber Writer. He asked a question pretty specifically. Here's the problem. Uh, we're not streaming this, so why would we do that? He was asked, yeah, this is uh, a <laughs> this is audio only. We're not doing the Shadow Rama MST3K thing. Yeah. So, 
And, and again, I'm going to be stepping back, so that's not for me to decide anyway. Yeah. Yeah. It doesn't matter if they're a VTuber or not, as long as they got the audio chops, you know, who cares? Exactly. All right. You'll uh, be, you, will, you heard, not seen. Exactly. Uh, say hello, one. You're going to hate me for this, but if Otto was given a Sentai to redo, which one would you want to see him do? Odds are good he's going to end up doing Go Ranger because you're going to start. Or Jacka. Or Jacka. One of the first One of the first two, definitely. Yeah, he's going to start with the first ones because that's, that's how he's been doing. He's doing Shin Ultraman, Shin Kamen Rider. Odds are going to do, he's going to do, like, it's going to be a Shin Sentai, so it's probably going to be Shin Go Ranger. Shin Go Ranger, one of the early ones, either that or Jacka. Jacka was a little bit more uh, more serious than Go Ranger, so I wouldn't put either past him. But honestly, yeah. I don't know how you do that in the span of two hours. I mean, you'd have to really condense some things. I mean, hell, look at how Power Rangers 2017 did it. Yeah, there was a lot of stuff. I my bet would be go ranger would be the first one because i've read the manga you could easily adapt that into a, a at least a good chunk of it into a two-hour movie or at least a 90 minute movie yeah jack would be a little it, it would be a little trickier i mean how do you explain the, the big giant pods that transform you into that sentai suit well they'd, they'd probably update that plus they'd also decide if they're going to bring a big one or not but we're, we're trailing off here yeah we've got a lot more questions rails rails all right, YGM, least favorite thing about Deno, the series, not the movies, just the series. Worst fan? <sighs> honestly, honestly, and this should come as no surprise, de-aging Hana. I know why they had to do it. Doesn't mean I have to like it. Yeah. I just, I, maybe they should have gotten a different actress to play her at the same age or something. That would have made a little bit more sense. But, uh, yeah, I think, I think. I, I can't confirm this, but I think that changed the storyline, too, in the ending, which I'm not really a fan of, but that's a whole video to, you know, yeah. if, I ever, if we ever get that, you know, released. Exactly. All right, and all right, guys, let's get some more questions in, guys, because we're running a little short here. DJ Toku, uh, for easy, worst gun in Kamen Rider. Uh, hmm, that's a tough one. Uh, dang. Hmm. That's tricky. I know uh, I'm not a fan of the, well, it's not really a gun per se, but I'm not a fan of the, I'm not a fan of the gun mode of the perfect Zector from Kabuto. I just thought it looked a little silly. I mean, it's a boomstick, don't get me wrong, but, uh. I think it works better as a sword. Turning it into a gun was kind of stupid. Yeah, it's a bit much, too, especially when you add all the executors onto it. Yeah. If I had to pick another one, that's kind of silly, but I know why they made it that way. It would be the it would be a, a Michi's gun in Gaim. Although, call me crazy, I still kind of want one. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, but uh, there's a few others. There's a few in Revice I don't like, but I don't want to spoil anything because Chase and Maddie haven't watched. I don't think they've watched a one of that. <laughs> nope. Yep. Though I was thinking, before we wrap things up on Tokaris, we could do something with that, with Revice, because we still have one more movie night we wanted to do that we never got around to. Yeah. And instead of doing another movie, what if we just watched the first two episodes of Revice? Hey, we could do that. You know, Hell just to yeah. get to uh, get your general impressions of it. Yeah. I mean, Hell yeah. Why not? There's a there's a three part all female writer mini series okay, going on too that I'm interested in as well. Pretty sure you'd have to watch Revice to get part of the jokes there, part of the references. Something there, like so. that. It's basically all the all the living female writers showing up. Well, some, but some are only doing voice roles. But uh, still, I want to see that, too. But anyway, anyway, next question. All right. We did get a couple more coming in. What is the most anticlimactic fight you've ev you've seen in Kamen Rider or Sentai? Ooh. Uh, oh, oh, I know one. The final fight in Drive. When uh, when uh, Shinosuke and Hart look like they're about to, you know, throw down, and then they don't. 
that was kind of a letdown. Yeah. And I thought that was going to be a knockdown, drag out fight, but then they just end up talking. I'm like, really? But yeah, uh, there's a few others. Um, there, there's a few others, but that one's just off the top of my head. Yeah, because with that, the final fight ends up being just shit. Sonosuke blasting away at a giant at a giant AI computer. Basically, yeah. And uh, any 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 common rider fight where it's just two guys suspended in the air, rider kicking each other, it's kind of stupid. Case in point, common rider Yango. That that they're like in the air kicking each other, rider kicking each other for two minutes before one of them breaks through the others. Honestly. Now that I think about it, guys, Toku's kind of stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the laws of physics go right out the window when two guys are dueling rider kicks. I mean, it looks cool for a second, but after uh, like a minute or something, you're looking at your watch, which is something you shouldn't be doing. But yeah. And yeah, you go, you go, you go, oh, pretty rider kicks two seconds later. Wait, what? Yeah. Brain cells kick in, you're going. How does that shit work? Will someone just kill someone? Right? Anyway. anyway. Next question. DJ Toku, what do you think an Ano driven Giver would be like? A Pretty Giver. much the same as the anime. Like, I, I don't see him doing literally anything different. And if you watch the Bio Booster Armor Giver anime, it's pretty gruesome. It's pretty, uh, pretty visceral. I, I so. think we watched. Honestly, first... I don't see him changing one thing. No, I, I remember we watched the first episode of the anime on the anime Mavericks a while back. Yeah, I remember it was pretty. It was much. I mean, we didn't get to the yeah. really gruesome stuff, but. Oof. So yeah, honestly, I don't see him changing a damn thing. All right, uh, Sela, I, if I've asked this before, my mistake. But if the Abyss deck had been used in Dragonite, who do you think it should have been given to? Uh, I can't think of anybody. No. It, 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 even if it was in Dragonite, it just probably would have been a one-off character. Kind of like, uh, what's his name, who was, uh, given the chameleon one, or, uh, the, 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 uh, the crab guy. I can't remember any of their names, I'm sorry. But, uh, yeah. Probably just but it would have been a one-off fight for a Lin and Kit. Okay, I'm going to mute my so, yeah. phone for a little bit because, good lord, this thing's going off like crazy. All right, anyway. So, uh, DJ Toku, which rider has the coolest bike or whatever they have a la Driver Aqua? Uh, I like bikes who aren't that aren't always crotch rockets. Like, I have a soft spot for choppers because my dad was a biker or Harleys. Yeah. And the ones that are closest to that are either Hibikis, which he doesn't even ride as an Oni, not a rider, <laughs> and Kivas. I mean, that bike just looks badass. Yeah. But um, those are those are ones I, I have a soft spot for. And, of course, the Denbird. But, you know, <laughs> that's more that's more of a motocross bike. And, of course, I got to go with my boy. I got to go with my day flow on this one. The versatility of the hard boilder being able to change out into different forms for whatever need, whatever use they need just added so much. It made the hard boiler a bike that they actually used more than just once or twice. Yeah, back when actually common riders did actual common riding. What about you, Maddie? Let me I guess, Tri Chaser? Yeah. I gotta go with my boy Kuga. There you go. <laughs> How did you know? <laughs> <laughs> Wild, I mean. guess. Wild guess. <laughs> I like the look of, of the bike X, uh, that Zero One used whenever they used it, of course. It, it was a very rare sight. Oh, yeah. It, would, match, it, it wasn't a bad looking bike. No. Oh, also, the ride vendor from O's was also good. Oh, yeah. Any, any, uh, any vending machine <laughs> vehicle is pretty badass. I, I even like the hover bike from Revice, even though he only used it like once or twice. But again, we're getting ahead of ourselves. Yeah. All right. Anyway, uh, Mr. Bacon, uh, question first before I before I go into this. Have any 
Easy, I'll assume you have seen this, but Maddie and I, have we seen the, I don't think you, have you seen the Yodana V Cinema? Oh no. my god, I, for, I forgot that that was a thing. See, this is why, this is why uh, this season assist has wrecked me, because usually we watch this shit on Tokarist, and that's usually when I watch it for the first time. Now I have to track this shit down like the old days, and I've honestly forgot that the Yodana V Cinema exists. Yeah. And you'd think, you'd think, since since I was crushing on you, Donna, so hard when we were watching Kira Major that I watched it. I've not watched that yet, so I don't, I haven't seen it. Something um, we need, something we'll need to do uh, once we start doing our, our, our era of the of Tokarest. It's just keep we'll tracking see. every fucking thing. We'll see. We might have to play a huge game of catch up. We'll see. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I'm going to have to go ahead and uh, reject that one for now. Yeah. Sorry, buddy. All right, uh, we'll make this the last question here. Kier Crystal, hypothetically speaking, would the Kuga manga be turned into an anime one day a la Futa P.I.? I... I uh, maybe, but honestly, I, I don't see it having the... the uh, 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 what's the word I'm looking for? The, the ease of of turning into an anime like Futo P.I.S. I mean, the transition from manga to anime has been all, has been nothing short of smooth. The yeah. Kuga one, I, I don't know. Yeah. And also Tough. Futo, the reason why Futo P.I. did so well is because the Fut, the Futo Tantai manga did fucking gangbusters all over the place. And they just struck at the right time with Toei wanting to bring more Kamen Rider to the, to the States. And, to be fair, Futo P.I. is fucking killing it right now. Like, they are hyping the shit out of that anime. It gets better and better every episode. And yeah. I, yeah. And I, I, I got a premium Crunchyroll account to watch it. What does that tell you? <laughs> <laughs> I don't see Kuga having that same drawing appeal. There's, it's because Double was such a renowned Kamen Rider series, such a beloved Kamen Rider series. And that's not to say Kuga isn't loved, but the same level of love that Double had... Kind of hard to really say that as much as I well, want to. Kuga, Kuga's kind of been Toei's whipping boy in the past. I mean, we saw the royal screw job it got in the Geo movie. I know Maddie's still fuming about that. And they turned Kuga into Decade's butt monkey, which I'm still not over. I call all the bullshit on that. Hashtag not my Kuga. Uh-huh. So yeah, honestly, I don't think Toei has any as uh, I don't think to, uh, Toei loves Kuga enough for them to, to do that. Plus the whole the whole uh, Joe Odagiri fiasco. <sighs> yeah, I I just um, to, uh, I'll I'll put this in in a in an Arnold quote for Maddie. You damaged goods, lady. Yeah, pretty Good much. Call. Yeah, sorry, Kuga. Hopefully one day you'll get the respect you deserve. You damaged goods, Kuga. Yep. Here's hoping. Hey, there's still there's still the series, and the minute I have the ability to buy that Blu-ray, I'm buying it. Yeah. I just have to save up save up oh, for uh, the the you know the the thing. Oh, I've already pre-ordered it. You know me. That was a day one pre-order. Yeah, no, right. I, I don't blame you. Yep. And and uh. Uh, we should be getting our Gavon Blu-rays next month. Hey, there you go. Sweet. That being said, let's go ahead and move on here, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get back to our uh, our regularly scheduled program because it's getting about that time. So let's yeah. go ahead and come on, boy. <laughs> and you boys should be thankful you guys never have to hear the loud transitions I have to listen to every time now. We used to. Yeah, you but not used anymore. to, but yeah, you don't have to mop anymore. I do. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, speaking of which, Maddie, have you been watching the new season of Archer? No, it skips my oh mind. Oh my god, that last episode had me on the floor, dude. Get caught up, seriously. Oh god. I absolutely need to be caught up. I keep forgetting it's on after Dynamite, and then I, I try to get some sleep before work, I just end up watching it on Hulu the next day. You know, to be fair, after two hours of good wrestling, you you want to rust a little bit. Yeah. Tad, yeah. 
Anyway, let's go ahead and get back to it, ladies and gentlemen. Get your streams pulled back up here, and let's get this started. Mega Beast Investigator Just Beyond, Episode 18. The Unstoppable Red-Eyed Combat Android. Yeah, same, try saying that five times fast. In three, two, one, play. Haven't we had enough flamethrowers tonight? Right? Seriously. Oh, that sucks, Mario. Just beyond uh, locked behind premium? Bummer. Ah, oh, no. fuck. Well, I know it's streaming somewhere else, but I just don't remember where. Was it Pluto TV? No. Uh, it was another, I think it was a Retro Crush or some other site like that. You might want to oh, try that one. Oh, maybe. Yeah. Or High Dive, one of those. It's probably on High Dive. Hang on, like Google, that. Googling that fucker. <laughs> Let me just pull up my streaming, Toku streaming Rolodex here. Yeah, I used to have a fan sub Rolodex, but I wouldn't know where to get such things. Officially. <laughs> For anybody from Toei listening. <laughs> Midnight Pulp. That's where it's ah, You know what's crazy? I have uh, the Plex app, because I have Fire TV, because I got it uh, during Prime Day. I have Plex, and they uh, and one of the channels they, they stream is Midnight Pulp. Yep. So check that site, too. I don't know. Uh, I don't know what... Uh, I don't know what their situation is, but couldn't hurt. You can't get killed for trying. Now you're playing Simon. Beep, 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 beep. Be honest, guys. Am I overdressed? No, no, sir. You're just fine. Ah, you can tell he's evil because of the sinister eyeliner. God damn, that's good. My makeup work. And maybe he's born with it. Maybe it's maybe Maybelline. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, it's Binya. I mean, Mia. Sorry, let's took it for Gullah Gullah Island for a second. <laughs> Binya, Pops Binya. Hmm? Pops, anyone remembers that show? I don't know, because my, my daughter used to watch it when she was real little. Ugh. Just be honest, have you adopted these kids? Or is there some speed arrangement where if you stay too long away from these kids, a bomb will go off? Does anybody remember why he came to Earth? I want to see was... my daddy. Then I want to wake up and, and hopefully beat up CM Punk with his own damn move, which is my damn move. <laughs> yeah. Your computer doesn't trust Midnight Bub? That's weird. Works fine for me. Got it on the phone just fine. Yeah. Whoa! 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 Damn, boy, I didn't have to kill him. Learn to park, dumbass. Hey! Oh! That's why he came to Earth. Thanks for reminding me. Yeah, thank you for reminding us. Honk, honk. Hey, Disco Boy, move your ass. I gotta get to work. Just beyond more over the Disco Inferno. Boom! God damn, that canary got hot real quick. The canary. Gas! Out of the hole! You just insult my eyeliner. Bitch! Slut! Peter Gabriel? <laughs> I'm on my way, I'm making it big time! 
So what you're telling me is you're not going to take it anymore. Yep. Hang on, gotta go see him. The, gotta go sing the theme to WrestleMania 25. Or was it 20, <laughs> or 24? 23. Oh, 23. That was fun to be down there. Let's go up here. Wait, weren't you just on Earth? That, you know what? Never mind. Hey, don't put that in the shredder. I just got that. You bit. Oh, uh, I think it's a scanner. Oh, that's fair. Wow. That's actually good detective work. Well, short show then. Good night, everybody. Ba, 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 da, 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 da. All right, um, I'm going to have to prep another button here. Yep. Tarp. Yeah, there someone call Akbar. On that one. It's a trap. Yep. Uh, now I just see if I can get some man cow here. Here in my car, I can look for my folks. I can even fight the devil in cars. Wait a minute. Some kids were playing mumbly peg here. Someone is is not covering well those those potholes very well. Someone buried a perfectly good Atari out here. Huh, just beyond. Not an idiot. You're in the middle of all four of them, you dumbass. What if you're not what if they're not proximity mines but remote mines? Someone tells me someone tells me just beyond does not play Goldeneye. Well, he'll have plenty of time to do that when it comes to Switch. Oh, oh Zonba, I wanted the big boss, not you, you lame scorpion knockoff. Get over here! <laughs> guys, 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 you're supposed to aim for him, not the ground. Ugh. God, you guys make stormtroopers look like sharpshooters. Seriously. That is saying something. Your eyeliner is crooked. Yeah, so is your mustache. So is your beard a little sideways, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna I'm not gonna make it about that, Macho Man. <laughs> Pull my finger. Come on, I dare you. Uh that's not bullshit. Uh, I don't know what is. Wow. Also, that See, was even just was like, cut. it must be a trap. Base dumbass is picking up on your bullshit. Yeah, this shit By the way, uh, Mario, uh, there is a, Midnight Pulp is an app on, on Google Play, and I'm pretty sure if you have an iPhone, it's the same thing. Yep. Just Beyond is, is on that for free. You should be fine. Yeah, the problem is or, I think that is required ads. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, just uh, try to catch the on-demand, buddy. Sorry, folks. I tried. <laughs> that's why. That's why we record these for your convenience. Yep, and I usually try to upload these to YouTube right after the show, but I don't always Wait, succeed. What? Is this he's the a, house from the from Spider Invasion? Was it? Aha! Oh, oh god, you've been hitting the booze again. Also, yeah, um, Chase is a busy man, folks. Give him a break, mm -hmm. especially now. How many houses did they blow up? Yes, I, think it, I thought it was just one, but it was like four. Thank God my tight pants saved me. Oh, oh, it's the big one. I'm coming, Elizabeth. And try not to aim too low this time. Jeez. You could punch him from that distance. How can you miss? Seriously. That was point effing blank. 
I mean, okay, you, you dehensioned him, fine, but still. Yeah, the Ninjas in Miami connection could have gotten him. Jesus, that's saying something. Yeah, yeah. no shit. And those guys went, dude. Those guys, those guys went down with one kick. <laughs> Mobsters and Samurai Cop probably would have had a better run with it. Oh, oh clip oh, is oh. on. They actually Damn, got a hit. Right. My God, it's a God miracle. Hey, look, he's doing he's doing his Hudsucker impression. Oh. Meanwhile, Alan Rickman plummets by. Well, I thought I saw a metal hero. I did, I did. It's just beyond. I was hurt about the bird. Well, at least it's not. Well, at least it's not the golden child. Then we'd have to deal with Eddie Murphy stuttering. I, 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 I want the knife. I, 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 I want the knife. You kids seen a little? You guys seen a little Asian kid around here, about that height? Now, could she turn down your two watt LED? Or twenty watt LED? Is it? We're about to load up a Spaceballs joke here. Is it really you? I guarantee it. Would I lie? Yeah, I have the fool you button, button on way, standby. John. Yeah, the fool you. What happened to your perm, though? That perm was so luxurious. Why did you get it cut? Well, Dad, they, they shot my shoulder. And they threw me off a cliff. And, and this big glowing bird saved me. And they took it too far. Ooh, that's quite a raspberry. God damn, he got shot. Ooh, looks like he took ten chops by Ric Flair to the chest. The Machine Empire? What does King Mondo have to do with this? Right? Seriously. Also, Dad, how come you're so white? <laughs> when do we let a Caucasian into our toku? Probably dubbed over him, though. Yeah. Also, I haven't seen a beard that fake since Richard Keel and Ega. Oh God damn, yeah. But again, it's Richard Keel trying to cover trying to cover up that chin is an impossible thing. Very true. Here are some shots to amalgamate that there actually was a war. Or they're not exactly good shots, but they are shots nonetheless. Yeah. Acting. Oh God! <laughs> My meme God. challenge! Oh, no, that is a meme challenge. <laughs> That's who he reminds me of—a young Michael McDonald. Taking it to the streets, taking it to the streets. Captain Power and the and the soldiers of the future. Yeah. What a fool believes he sees. None of us have that high pitch of voice. No, easy. not even going to try. <laughs> not even going to try. Someone had to. Yeah. What a fool believes. I can't do it. I can't. Cannot do it. Also the theme song for creationism. <laughs> <laughs> Zomba is an android. Oh, thank God. I was fighting and I thought I was fighting an iPhone for a second. Mm, Got to go. Sorry, they only paid us for the one scene. That's all you get. Oh, why couldn't my dad have been someone cool like Sonny Chiba? He's healed. Huh, guess we don't need the Spaceballs button after all. Oh, wait a minute. Hold that thought. Well, not on the uh, not on the parents. The man bearing this cave is is crazy. Do nothing he says. 
Ooh. Be sure to drink your Ovaltine. Son, Son of, of a bitch. bitch. Ugh, I'm up, I'm up. What do you want? I was watching my soaps with Keeper. Do you mind? He talks about mommy and daddy. He just he, he just loses a couple of years off his life, right? He's like he gets younger. Lionel, you must become Lord of the Thundercats. Wait, which show am I in? <laughs> Well, the golden bird actually uh, seeked me because it uh, saved my life. <sighs> Can't wait to hear this story at the Metal Hero picnic. Gavon, well, I stopped the whole Maku Empire. Shervon, Scheider... It's like, yeah, we stopped uh, Empires too. Just beyond. I chased a fucking bird around. Pose for fanciness. But a while since we've seen a prophension sequence from him. Hell yeah. Like, let's keep it that way. Or let's let's uh let's let's see more of that. Comb the quarry! Uh, never mind, he's over there. What are you kidding? I have to stand on a higher level to uh, berate you guys. Haven't you ever seen a Toku series before? Besides, it's only for I cannot have the high ground. Yep. Theme insert. Oh, you guys are screwed. Oh, oh yeah. That, that is the theme song to your fucked. Yeah, pretty much. Damn. That thing's got some firepower. Holy shit. That thing's like a mini cannon. I haven't seen a cannon that I haven't seen a gun that powerful since Brick Bardo's gun in Dollman. And that thing can literally blow holes in people. Ow! Oh, you popped my back it, you dick! Ow! Oh! There's the receipt. Ah, my face! My valuable face! Packers! Packers! I'm gonna see. I'm gonna run here and see what you do with this. Oh, well, okay. Ouch, then. <laughs> I think you got him. Damn, just beyond. You didn't have to kill him. Ooh, he got me all steamed up. Japanese, ja Japanese 80s Bane. Let off some steam, Bennett. Oh shit, he's a fucking Terminator. Dun, 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 I dun, dun. knew it. Dun, 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 dun. Desire is irrelevant. I am a machine. Hakaider, you're in the wrong show. Of course, I'm on the right show. I'm Hakaida. How am I going to fuck up this come on boy over there? Oh, and of course, now that he's turned full android, he walks like a fucking robot now. Of course, because I'm a goddamn android. I'm a Terminator. Ugh, the robot girl and super robot woman in Superman three was creepier than this thing. That's for sure. And that Fuck. legit gave me nightmares when I was a kid. Fuck. Oh, wow. <laughs> it still does. Just thinking about it gives me nightmares. I'm starting to think this guy has some weird choke chain S and M fetish going on. He's probably a big Frankie goes to Hollywood fan. Relax! Don't do it! Hey, he's got a built-in photo printer. That's handy. Let's see, parents. I killed them. Both of them. Ripped the necks off. Are we supposed to feel something? Because he's just burning a picture. Again, he's doing a hawk hider. This is what I do with justice. I burn it. God, that dub is so bad. 
<laughs> Shout out to you, Matt, wherever you are for reviewing that. We miss you, buddy. Oh, yeah. Actually, did you see the whole... Uh, Dr. <laughs> He's ragdolling him! He's fucking ragdolling him! By the way, speaking of Hot Kider, did you see that documentary he put together? Indeed. That was really good. Mm-hmm. Give me a link to that. I need to watch that. I'll pull that up why for you, you after the show. What do you think I'm trying to... Why do you think I'm trying so hard to get that on the last drive-in? Oh! Didn't even oh, hit him, but he blew up anyway. Oh, that look at the man ahead! Oh! Ah, two's but a scratch. A scratch, scratch your arm's off. off. No, it isn't, you liar. Come on, you pansy. It's just a flesh wound. That's been our theme for the night. Just complete uh, disarming. Yep. Huh. You are nothing. Yeah, you are nothing but a choir boy good compared to me. A fucking choir boy. Dang. I'm pretty badass in this one. Why didn't I do this three episodes ago? Seriously, I should have I should have dug on Android mode. Fucking kill you and your parents and that fucking Android chick you have up there. He's giving just beyond a real hand job. Amazing. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh. oh, I have the vapors. I'll be back. Fuck, that voice is more over than Disco Inferno. Jesus. Talk to the hand. Oh! My hand is on my neck. I'm oh, burning your eyes out. My Gaston, you idiot. You're terminated, fucker. I'll be back. No, he won't. I don't think he'll be back from that. We could easily gang up on you right now, but nah. Yeah! Fuck. Get away from me, you overgrown furry. Don't tell me. They ran yeah. away again! <sighs> Those kids are more trouble than the villains in this show, I swear. The kids uh, or the parents? Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm free. I'm free. So long, you little rats. <laughs> Time to hit the casinos. Oh, and they went to SeaWorld. They took Just Beyond's wallet, didn't they? Because SeaWorld tickets are not cheap. Yeah. Papa, can you hear me? Do you daddy, want to no man? And daddy, no daddy wasn't there. <laughs> they fucking will. Walkies now. Oh, I just pulled over. You're just gonna have to hold it. God help you if you accidentally stain that upholstery back there. God help you. <laughs> if there is one stain on the upholstery back there. I hope just be on scotch guarded that. Double layered while you're at it. Indeed. Mm. One thing I've always wondered about these shows, or these Metal Hero shows, the heroes always drive these badass sports cars. Makes me wonder, sure the kids want the toy of it, but how many guys watched this show and thought, yeah, I want that car. I mean, it's got to be like uh, someone, wa a guy watching Smokey and the Band is like, yeah, I want that Trans Am or watching Knight Riders. Like, yeah, I want that Firebird. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> or, you know, I mean, I, I saw there's got to be a few guys in Japan who wanted that. That Yeah, I saw a dude on TikTok has a one-for-one -one replica. Like, he built it himself of, of Kit. Nice. Even has a computer a computer TV thing that actually he was able to play Mario Brothers on it. 
Nice. Oh, goody. We're going after the kids again. Oh, joy. Not even one fucking episode, kids. Oh, it's a beach episode. Oh, go oh goody. Sending out an SOS. Uh, oh, boy. That should be fun. Yeah. Yeah. Anyone hoping that Just Beyond will finally wise the fuck up and be like, okay, kids, screw it, you're on your own. I got a whole world to protect here. Oh, just keep them on the damn ship for a while. Right? Seriously. Yeah. They well, know, they know he's going a fucking, to outer space. They know he's a fucking superhero at this point. Hey, okay. hey, kids, you want to see what my space Winnebago? Fuck. Henri is a better parent at this point. Hell, put him in cryostasis or something. Don't tell me you don't have something like that on the ship. We should have. Okay, seriously, when we get to get to that, Spielbond needs to be a watch. Needs to be a must watch on our show. Dang well, it. if it ever gets an official release, we'll see. We or maybe not. Shifty eyes. <laughs> yeah. All right, one more to go. <laughs> so it's time to raise our hands to the skies and say his name. Ah, yes. Good old Zetto. Time for another episode of Will Zet Get Laid. Spoilers, the answer's probably no. <laughs> no. No. Short answer, no. Long answer, no. Okay, there, duh. Okay, there, Yahtzee. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't, I don't think I didn't catch that reference. <laughs> <laughs> I was watching Yahtzee during those days. Oh, I, I know he's still around. I just haven't watched his shit in a long fucking time. Yep. He's still got it, to be fair. Also, it's funny. We got we got Ultra 7. We got his kid, Zero. And we got zero student. We've kind of come full circle here, haven't we? Yeah. Let's see if uh, let's see if Zach can uh, can channel some of that awesomeness. Or does, does or no, gonna... zero doesn't have any. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see what we can do here. Ultraman Zetto, episode twelve, the cry of life. In three, two, one, lay. Hmm. Cry of life. I thought that's what you did before a work shift. Yeah. No. <laughs> no, just leave it the fuck in. Hmm. One of the perks of working from home, folks. I'm going to miss I'd that. Like, yeah, I'd like to know that feeling someday. Ugh. You Are you taking a leak in our in the ultra zone here? Shut up. I can do whatever the fuck I want, dad. Uh, phrasing. phrasing. <laughs> Seriously, could you not look at me while I'm going? I can't go when someone's looking. T turn around. Ugh, I knew I shouldn't have had all that asparagus. Well, that, I guess we're not getting an intro this time. Oh, yeah, that happened last time. Oh, yeah. That's right, this is the part two. Got your, got your ass handed to you. Again, Mario... That's why we have On Demand. When you got all the episodes, you can come back and watch anytime. And this is on YouTube. Yes. But, uh, yeah, Midnight Paul uh, violating its illegal download policy. What? What? Oh, give me a... Don't take this the wrong way, Mario, but your school system's fucked up. Uh, dorm, oh, I'm assuming. I told you we should have charged this thing before we left. Timber! I told you we should have put in more than 20 bu 10 bucks left in. Cut 10 bucks. Oh, oh, there's, there's our intro. intro. 
10 bucks for gas that's funny <laughs> that won't Space even get your quarter just... gallon <laughs> no nope. well, i know but this day day. <laughs> yeah that but... worth it. yeah we're yeah we're so old we remember when five dollars worth of gas was a lot yeah yeah I, I, yeah that, that's a thing gas for more than over a dollar that's insane <laughs> uh you have no idea right and Easy and I are not the drivers. Yeah. But everyone in my family wants to use my fuel points. Mm-hmm. So, I have to make it worth my while, is all I'm going to say. Huh. Not exactly a boarding the ship from Apollo 13 uh, intro, is it? Hang on, hang on. You got a big piece of chive stuck in those teeth. Yeah, you got to floss that tread, that stuff. By the way, is it just me or the uh, subtitles are a little gray? Yeah, yeah I, I can barely I read I, them. I can't control that. For, I don't know why it does it's that. It's okay. All right, that's fair enough. It's, yeah. You can get the gist, get the gist of it. We can still read them. It's just something we noticed. Yeah. Commercial. Look. And the uh, still fucking loud commercials. Will someone seriously complain to Super I about that? Yeah, look how low I've got the volume on my end here. God. Just man. imagine if I had that thing on full blast, we blast our eardrums out. Thank well, God I don't have earphones on. Well, John, since you brought it up earlier, mop, 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 mop. mop, mop. Mop. Man, okay. I don't even have that lot to begin again. with. What? Going right for Gamma, it looks like. Indeed. Say my name. Who's your daddy, bitch? Who is your daddy and what does he do? <laughs> and oh, it's just eh. Yeah, and that cockpit is soaked. Yep. My ultra chat has come for me. And cut the pan pooby. Sploosh. Yep. Wow, going straight for the sword. We're not fucking around today. Nice. Oh, he's summoning a Doctor Strange portal. Oh, oh no, wait, no, giant buzzsaw. Never mind. Just pulling out the old Destructo disc. Oh, Zoro is such a show off. Wait, oh, never mind. <laughs> huh? Wait a minute. Oh. Yeah. It's the mama. Uh, that's okay. Z- that's okay, Haruki. It happens to the best of us. Uh, okay. Truce, 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 truce. Shit. Mother. To quote Ghostbusters 2, that was really stupid. (laughs) Don't have a panic attack, old man.
Okay, that is coming out of your pay. But I'm not getting paid. Well, not now you're not. Oh, go make a ring, old man. Well, then get more fucking coolant, then. Get an AC get in there. Get on it, Velma. Ah. Ew. Oh, what the fuck? Oh. Ugh. Well, I've lost my appetite again. No shit! Oh, God, She's like Rian. the only one not going. But don't worry, I got nose plugs. Ugh. This is like when Mel Brooks played Van Helsing in Dracula Dead and loving it. He was he was cutting apart that corpse and all the other guys were fainting. Oh, uh-oh. Oh, 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 oh heartburn. Oh. Heartburn. Can you give me a Zantac? Oof. It seemed like a good idea at the time. You gotta love how they, in Toku, they always leave a sleeping monster there. He could never wake up and, you know, go on a killing spree again. We can't use Joe. He's too busy on being the ROH TV champion. He'd have an easier time fighting Samoa Joe, actually. Yeah. And Haruki, will you get rid of that dumb fanny pack? Uh, this isn't a fanny pack, sir. I keep my... Never mind. See, that ad we'll wasn't that loud. That was fine. Keep it at that level. Yeah. We'll be right back. And we're back. Ugh. At that moment, he knew he fucked up. Again. Oh, who am I kidding? Ugh, who am I? Uh, who am I kidding? Raleigh Beckett was a better pilot than I am. Well, fighting monsters would imply that you guys have actually fought a monsters and not have your metallic asses getting kicked every episode. Again. I mean, only one of you have actually done any monster fighting. Get off his dick. Yeah, what if the egg hatches? Then we'll have another monster running around. This is an infestation problem right here. Yeah, it's not their fault they stomp on buildings, pagodas, kill hundreds and thousands of people. Well, first you have to grin, then bear it. That's it. Feel the burn. Wow, 
I think we we're getting the opposite of Ultra Seven here. Instead of a instead of a, co- a cold blooded killer, we got a guy who's having remorse for killing. Yeah, but I do like yeah. what she said earlier about it's not like she's proud or happy to kill them, but she also knows they don't have a fucking choice. It's the law of the jungle here, survival of the fittest. Sure, they've killed thousands of people and wrecked, done, and have done countless damage to the planet. But, but, but deep down, why didn't I take DDP yoga instead? looks like me after climbing up the three flights of stairs with all the groceries in hand. Ugh, he's powered by he's powered by avatar farts. Or is that smurf urine? Do something. Do something. Shing. Do something. Surely this one will succeed where the others have failed. So our plan is to launch another giant robot at the Monster of the Week. They'll never see it coming. Can't we just rip off the monster's arm and beat him with it? Oh wait, no, we already did that. We already did that once. I just said that, you dumb bitch. Oof, feel bad for all the workers down there. It's like someone smoked an entire carton of menthols and blew it in my face. Aw, well, I hope it's a trial separation. Yeah. Oh, please, no more golden birds. We've had our fill. Smile, you son of a bitch. (laughs) You know, it's hard for me to feel sorry for a monster with a giant fucking cannon on its back. That's like expecting me to feel sorry for a death claw in Fallout. Though, surprisingly enough, there is a mission where you actually do help protect the Deathclaw child. And, yeah, an egg. Yeah, I've played that one. But I believe you get the option to either save it or cook it. (laughs) That was like an extendo boxing glove. That's why I always carry this handy-dandy extendo boxing glove. Wee! Uh, yep. Ooh, 
when did we start tuning into a Super Sentai? <laughs> Feels like it, doesn't it? Hell, this is down. This is uh, bordering on Takara Tomy levels of mech. Oh, atomic fire! Oh, she's dead. Short show. Oh, wait, never mind. I guess you could say she tanked that blast. Huh? Huh? Yeah. Weasel unit total assault! <laughs> oh, that tickles. Ah, stop it, stop it. <laughs> that tickles. Real good thing beams don't explode on impact. Oh, wait, never mind, they do. Different physics. They hog tied that critter. Woo, doggy. Woo. Woo now squeal like a pig. Joe, 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 Oh, why did I make those hooks out of paper mache? We suck. Oh, God damn. Are you, sure this is, are you sure we're not watching Pacific Rim? Because this thing is definitely on the same level as those kaiju. Oh, oh, that's not good. Suck. 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 Oh, great time to cut to commercial. Oh, wow. Ugh, one day I'll get around to reading this. Have they released an om have they released an omnibus of this yet, or are they still uh they still just releasing issues? I'd like to read that crossover he's doing with the rest of the Marvel uh characters. Move, you piece of crap. All right, I'll save your bacon again. All right, I guess I'll have to kill you now. Time for the Alpha Ultra to right take over. Kick. Ultraman Leo would be proud of that kick. Yeah. Try not to puss out this time. Should I break off his arm and beat him with it? No, we've already done that. No, we're not monsters. This thing's just misunderstood. Ish. <laughs> Seriously, Ultra 7 pr probably would have torn that cannon off and used it on that monster by now. Oh, 
ah, I guess Tail Whip wasn't super effective this time. <laughs> Oh, not again. Get out of your own head, stupid. Oh, my God. Would you grow a pair? Just tightening. Ugh. Oh, wait, what wait. The what the hell, man? Well, whatever you're going to do, do it fast. Hey, Zed, are you dead? Not yet, but this should do it. If you don't, I'm going to leave you for your mentor. Well, wow, that thing's taking it forever to charge. Almost like for it's for dramatic effect. I've got this. I've got this. Yeah, she totally doesn't got this. Point blank. Oh! Big bada boom. Score one for the lady. Well, we can no longer say that the uh, non ultras can't get the job done. <sighs> Yoko, I am 110% more into you right now. <laughs> what was her You're... actress's name again? I need it for <laughs> research. Sure, research sure. Purposes. Sure. Hey, Ace would if he was still here. That was cold blooded. I think she went from sub to, to, to simp to dom. Right? My keys were in there. Jesus. Interesting development there. God damn. What is with this guy? Yeah. Well, it's official. Haruki's a wussy. We have officially hit the self-doubt cycle, ladies and gentlemen. I guess so. Oh, yeah. My God, man. I wouldn't even call this an existential crisis. This is more of an uh, in this insistential crisis. Cause we saw him talking to Zet. I wouldn't really call that an existential crisis. I guess next time at next episode, Zet's going to slap him upside the head and like quit being a wussy. Somebody's not yeah. the same. Either Zet's gonna do it or Yoko's gonna end up doing it. Now I'm hoping for the latter. I'm sure you would. <laughs> well, as Spike Spiegel said, you know the line. Yep. What's on the menu today? Nexus, my boy. Hey. Can't wait to get my hands on that Nexus DVD. Oh, 
Oh no! Took my stuff, man! <sighs> okay. An interesting man. feeling of events. I don't know about you guys, but I got ultra whiplash. A little yeah, bit. To yeah. say the least. We Shit. go from cold blooded killer to, to moral dilemma. Damn. Bet if Ultra Seven was here, it's like, they have really lowered the bar since my day. <laughs> <laughs> what you gonna do yeah i guess i mean i want to like you harky and zet but seriously man up i don't know about Look, you guys i'm starting to miss jeed i'm sure we'll get there eventually yeah well we'll see with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to do it for us here tonight on Tokaris Live. We hope you guys had a fun night tonight. If you enjoyed tonight's show and you haven't done so already, make sure you give us a follow to keep up with all our streams and more. And if you can't subscribe to get access to our exclusive Twitch emotes, our VIP Discord channels, and our loyalty badges. Speaking of Discord, if you have not taken the time to join our Discord server yet, we encourage that you do so. We're very active on there. We love talking with you guys. And it is the best place to find out what streams are coming on down the pipe because I usually try to keep the schedule up, schedule up to date. As for everything else, all of our commands are located in the About section below. Learn them, use them, love them, and they will love you. But in the meantime, we want to thank you guys for joining us as always here on RVTV on the Shades. My name's Manny J. Remind you to help professional wrestling support independent promotion as soon as possible. And I'm Easy Rider reminding you that, uh, well, again, to quote Ken Titus, when it comes to fighting a giant monster, don't be a wussy. <laughs> Can't keep more simple than that. Yep. Anyway, we'll see you guys next time. Rock on! Special thanks to my patrons like Voice. Subscribe today to make these streams even better. Also, thanks to Easy's patrons, including Chris Lee, Chris Froles, Michael Antignano, Stephen Harris, Galen Hanna, Alonzo Tompkins, Anthony Guidman, Matthew Golding Long, Dino, and super shout out to Eric Vaughn and Shane Thompson for their support.